Hi YouTubers, Jeff Cote here from Pacific Yacht Systems. We've got a question from Steve. Steve says, I've got a 1978 Taiwanese trawler uh, here in British Columbia, and I'm grateful for your electrical survey recommendations about three years ago. I've added lots of fuses that are close to VYC recommendations as possible, but I still don't know what condition of the wire runs are in the hidden chassis. What are the pros and cons of battery terminal fuses? That's a really good question, Steve. Um, the challenge with fusing is a lot of us, and certainly a lot of previous owners and a lot of do-it-yourselves, are thinking that the fuse could be located everywhere on the circuit. They're thinking it's only the purpose of the fuse is only to protect the appliance. And you're right, if you're only worried about fusing for an appliance, the fuse could be anywhere on the circuit. It doesn't have to be at the beginning. It could be right before the circuit itself. And a good point or analogy to that is a VHF radio. A VHF radio is commonly going to have a, v a fuse connected right to the power lead to the VHF itself. But we know that we don't only have to worry about the appliance, we also have to worry about the whole wiring. And the advantage with battery terminal fuses is that they actually fuse the circuit right at the battery. And so now you have a fuse that is not only meant to protect the wire, but also the appliance. So we use these marine rated battery fuses all the time in our solutions, and they're safe and they're great because they start the fuse at the beginning of the circuit. And then that way we're protecting both the wire and we're also protecting the appliance. So a big fan of marine rated battery fuses. Thanks for asking the question, Steve. If you've got further questions, please send them our way and thanks for watching.